Hi guys, it's April 15th, uh, 2013, so I thought I'd bring you up to date on what I've accomplished on the homestead. Got some tomatoes I'm going to put in. A little salad garden is coming up. We've got strawberries and raspberries here and I've got blueberries in the front planted in all that cedar mulch. <clears throat> A lot of dandelions. <laughs> Not something I'm gonna really weed. Uh, they're perfectly fine. This hugo culture bed, I'm gonna build it up a little bit farther before I start covering it with dirt. I'm gonna put the wood pile right over there on those railroad tie looking things. The other wood pile fell down, so I'm going to uh, restack it over there. Time to mow the lawn. <laughs> uh, let's see, what else did I do? I completed my smaller hugel culture bed. I probably could use a little bit more dirt around the base, but I basically covered the top, uh, covered most of the sides, planted it up with potatoes, beans, uh, uh, Swiss chard, um, and peas, I believe, and uh, then covered it with mulch, um, grass clippings, and wood chips. And it's an experiment. And it see how the uh, see how moist the soil is below the mulch. That's the trick. Over here, I'm doing a back to experimental back to Eden thing. I just bl threw it together really quick. I I've got peas around the sides, um, and I've got potatoes in the middle, and uh, I think I through some beans, I just broadcasted some beans and then covered it with mulch. I didn't disturb the soil other than raking the uh, the blackberries off of it and then uh, chipped up a uh, about two inches of mulch that I threw over it. And then I hilled it up under the potatoes a little bit. So, um, these are not very involved gardens not really big productivity things they're not it's not like farming but these things are um, they're basically supposed to be close to maintenance free so we'll see how they do uh, this is April 15th and let's see if how long it takes to get any sprouts going here oh uh, cherry trees really blossoming Man, if all, if even a third of these cherry blossoms uh, turn into cherries, man, I'm gonna have probably 90 pounds of cherries. <laughs> Good times. See ya.